Cleaning up our habits and streamlining our lives. Taking time out to neaten up what we need to neaten up. Hello, y'all. I'm Diana Brienne. You know, I got to thinking about how sometimes we clutter our lives up. And we've got so much going on. And a lot of it is unnecessary things that's taking up our energy, our time, our momentum. And it's not really giving us a whole lot. And sometimes it's actually taking away from us. It could be bad habits, or it could be less than habits. It could be relationships that really don't belong in our lives, or they should be in our lives at a minimum. And yet we are giving our time to these things day in and day out. I think sometimes that's why a vacation can be good in our life, because when we take a vacation, sometimes what happens is um, a vacation um, is a way for us to um, get away from our daily routines and get away from the things that we do each and every day that, um, that we kind of do mindlessly. We do without even really thinking about it. And sometimes when we go back, we look at things a lot different because we've had some time out from our daily routines. And so I believe that, um, that for me, for me, uh, sometimes I need to do that. Sometimes I need to clean the closet. Sometimes I need to clean the attic out. And, uh, and so sometimes our habits just need to be, um, we need to, you know, solidify the good habits, the great habits, Sometimes we need to replace habits, a bad habit with a good habit to a great habit or a bad habit to a great habit. Um, if you're going out to the all, you can eat buffet with your friends every day um, and hanging out. Maybe when you get back from that vacation, you're gonna say, hey, instead of going out with those friends, you know, seven days a week, I'm going to go to the gym seven days a week and make a new group of friends. So you're going from a bad habit to a great habit. And, uh, and some people go from a bad habit to a mediocre habit or an okay habit. And you know, okay habits are okay, but they're not necessarily great. And I, I you know, want to have great habits in my life, great relationships in my life. Um, you know, I don't want to overload my plate of life where I'm exhausted and tired so that when the great things come along, I'm too tired for them. I don't want to do that. I want to take time out to rest, recharge, renew. You know, sometimes step back and gain clarity so that I can go back into whatever it is, whether it's a job, relationships, where I live, uh, routines, whatever, and go back with clarity. Sometimes I say, hey, you know what, I'm going back, but I'm not going to include this in my daily routines. I'm not going to include that relationship on any kind of regular basis. I'm not going to um, have this kind of attitude or this kind of habit. When I go back, I'm going to go back with a renewed spirit and a renewed attitude and a positive one or I'm going to change jobs when I get back, or I'm going to um, you know, start at a gym when I get back, or I'm going to start new habits or whatever. So you know, sometimes we have to step back from our daily lives for just a little bit to gain perspective. And sometimes resting and recharging can do that for us, okay? Well, from my house to yours, may God bless you. I hope you like, share, subscribe, and I hope to talk to you soon again. Bye-bye.